is Friday, July 27th, morning like 10.30. Took Macy, try to find some pet trails here at like a park nearby. But they all say no pets, so I don't really know what we're doing. I'm just gonna keep walking until we find one, I guess. I thought I found one. Turns out it just took us to the other end of the parking lot, so. We'll see how far, or how long we end up staying here and how far we make it. Come on. We like the squirrels. So it looks like this is actually a trail. There's no one on it, I don't think, hopefully. And it's the only one that hasn't said like no pets yet. So I guess we'll just keep walking this one and see where it goes. It literally just looks like it's taking us around this like big parking lot. So that might be the extent of our adventure. I don't know where that trail goes. That's the only thing is I I don't know where all these go. I don't know why there are no pets. And there's a bunch of preschoolers here. Like, I don't know why. I don't know what's going on. But there's tons of kids here on a Friday morning. I don't know. We might just end up at the dog park. trail hopefully um, I just drove a little bit down the road and I turned into another part of the park this one says keep all pets on a leash so I'm assuming that we're allowed to be here that last trail trail I use loosely <laughs> that took us around the parking lot was like maybe a mile long maybe um, so we'll see where this one goes it's no shade whatsoever but it's a good day out, and supposedly we're where the bison hang out. I don't know if you consider them wild, because they're enclosed. <laughs> um, I don't know, we'll see where this takes us. It might be a little hot for Macy, so I don't know how long we'll stay. I did pack water, though, and stuff like that. So we'll see, if we hit any shaded areas, I'll, we'll probably hang out, but if there's no shade, I'll move make her stay out here. It's already probably close to 11, so we'll see. So far, so good. shade. It should be alright. It's pretty breezy out. Hopefully you can hear me. But found the bison. They're all just sleeping over there. I'll probably just take this loop around and head back to the car maybe. So today to Sarah's coming back over again. We're gonna hang out hopefully and go to another Columbus coffee shop. So we like to do that a lot, just we love coffee and we love visiting like new shops and taking cute pictures and just hanging out and 
finding these cute places. Some of them are really nice and cute and we love them and we want to buy their shirts <laughs> and then some of them are duds. So, ooh, there's a fork in the road. I don't know which way to go. Oh, I don't know which way to go. I don't know which way to go. Let's go this way. Pool season pasture look. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, we'll go this way. <laughs> um, yeah, but yeah, so hopefully I'll get some like cute footage of that. Ooh, fly landed on my son. Um, she's coming over later this afternoon. The shop closes at five in front of what I saw on Google. It's not very big, so I'll probably be outside a lot of the time, which is fine because look how gorgeous it is outside. Like it's supposed to be like 77 today. It's just partly cloudy blue skies. Macy's living her best life. This is great. Oh, this is cool. I'll have to flip the camera around to show you. Like this cute little overlook section of grass. I don't know if the bison were out here at one point. Like binoculars. And just this huge pasture. Oh, that's beautiful. It'd be cool if there was like something down there. I don't think there's anything down there. Okay, well let's hit the other trail that I was going to go down. Because this is the end of this. And we'll go down the other side. Was that cool, mate? I don't know, there's so many smells. I don't know what to do. So this is a cute little trail too that we're going down. There's like a little bridge. I don't know where this goes. We could end up walking like six miles today. Lord knows I need it. I ate like shit yesterday. It's not coming. Thank you. Come on. Oh, it's like the third time I've been told it's a pretty dog. Come on. We went to the gas station to get gas stuff for this. Um, and she was in the car. And I had a mom tell me her kid liked my dog. And then the guy next to me said she was pretty too. So, you know, I just take her everywhere with me. It really helps boost my confidence. <laughs> um, but this is a cute little little bridge area. I don't know if there's a lot of bikers. This is the third biker I saw and we've been here for like 20 minutes. So but yeah, this is the other workout for the day. I did not feel like going to the gym alone and Macy's been wired the past couple of days. So give her some exercise. I was going to take her to the dog park, but I needed to get my steps in too because I have not been feeling my best, but um, I work all day tomorrow, so there probably won't be much going on. I might hang out with Jacob, I don't know. Don't know yet. And then Sunday, my mom and my aunt and I are going to this like wine and canvas thing in Columbus, like short north area. Um, it's BYOB, so. I don't really know what you consider this, but um, you it's like paint your pet. So you like send them a picture of your pet and um, they'll like put it on canvas for you. And then it's like, I was reading this line. Um, this is a nice little area. Um, they put it on a canvas for you and it's like paint by number for like three hours and you just like hang out, paint and drink. And I love all those things. So I'm excited for it. It was like 60 bucks though. So this better turn out good. I better not get wasted. And I better make this the best painting I've ever done because Macy deserves it. I deserve it. And we're gonna hang it up in the living room. <laughs> There's more people coming, so I'll talk to you later. Okay, bye. <laughs> Um, if I look like a mess, it's because I am. Um, 
I think that trail we were going down was like miles long, like miles. Um, Cause we started like going off this way and our car was like all the way in the other direction. So we ended up, I just turned around and we jogged back. Um, so we probably went, I wanna say total today, like two or so miles. Um, but who knows really. And now I'm trying to get us back without maps because I'm on my phone. Um, Macy seems tired, which is great. She seemed to really enjoy that last trail we were on. She was sniffing all the sniffs, smelling all the smells, um, playing with snakes and bugs and whatever else. If I would have let her like off leash, she would have been gone like that because there's squirrels and um, she definitely is a, a chaser for sure. So, but she, she seemed to really enjoy it. She was peppy the whole time. We stopped for a water break about halfway through and she seemed to be doing great. So it was breezy and there was, there was clouds out so it wasn't too, too warm for her, I don't think. And I touched the like pavement with my hand and it like wasn't too hot, so she's, she's fine. She's tired, which is good because like I said, I'll probably be gone for most of the afternoon. This is not staying. Um, but yeah, I'm on my way home now to get us back. Sarah will probably be off around two, so she'll be probably around my house and ready to go by three or 3.30. So I'm going to get home and get cleaned up, change, my hair looks gross, but these glasses are prescription by the way, I know I normally wear my normal glasses, but not that you would know, I have like two videos up on my YouTube, um, <laughs> idiot, yeah, so I'll just be probably gonna go home and eat like a light lunch. I had like a breakfast sandwich for breakfast so I don't want to eat anything heavy or big for lunch as we'll probably get something while we're out here we're at the coffee shop. So I'll probably just have maybe some fruit and some yogurt for lunch. Um, I guess I get, get changed and start getting ready for the day. It was a fun little trail though. Um, it's a little bit of it's not too much driving, maybe like 15 minutes of, are you okay honey? Maybe 15 minutes of like driving to the trail, um, which isn't too bad. It was, it's a fun, fun little thing to do to get out of the house and get her a different, different scenery because normally I'll just walk her around my block, which is like not big at all. Like one time around my block is like half a mile. So I'll walk her like either twice or around like both sides, which ends up being a mile. But the other side of my neighborhood is like kind of gross and I don't like being over there. So we end up just like walking multiple times around my one loop. And I get bored, I'm pretty sure they get bored. They know it by heart, like they don't need me to walk them with them. Um, but yeah it was i think she enjoyed the scenery and we go to the same dog parks like all the time which is she enjoys the dog parks but if there's not many dogs there it's just a big fenced in yard and it's like friday in the morning so i did not think she there would be many dogs out right now last time i went on like a friday morning um there was like one other dog there so I don't know, I just didn't think there'd be many dogs there. So yeah, I, I, I enjoyed it. I'm glad we went. Good exercise for both of us. She, oh, she's tired. That's good. It means we did our job. Had a good day. All right, I'll talk to you later. Probably when I get, once I get like dressed and ready, if Sarah's not over yet, I'll whip you back out. Say bye, Mace. So I'm pretty much ready, waiting on Sarah to get here. Um, I have a massive headache, and I don't know if it's from 
being outside this morning in the heat. And I'm dehydrated, although I've been drinking water since I've been home. Or if it's like caffeine, because I didn't have coffee this morning. Um, so I'm hoping that when we get there, I mean, I have something that might get better, because right now I just like want a nap so bad. Um, we're just a little after three, so she should be here in like 15 minutes. Um, then I just kind of wanted to show you what I was wearing. Pardon my room, actually. But let's see, I'll do it like this. Um, oh my gosh, my room is a mess. I'm supposed to get my life together today, that didn't happen. Um, so I'm wearing those same distressed shorts that I wear every single day of my life. Um, this like black cropped pink top and then just this old flannel I've had since I was probably a freshman in high school. So, I look fat when I do it that way. I'm bloated AF from being a girl. Um, but this is a cute little outfit I'll probably wear. My makeup all did up like. Um, I'll probably wear. Oh, they're downstairs. Oh, they're downstairs. I have these like Converse that are this like maroon color. Um, speaking of maroon, I don't know what I want to do with my hair. Um, my hair used to be this like really pretty like bright red. Red, not like fire truck red, but it's like this deep bright ready violet color. I loved it. Love that color. Um, but recently I've been like lightening my hair to try to be like blonde because I thought that would be fun. But then I did I was working at the salon and I did a like red violet color and I was just like the whole time I was like oh, I love this color I miss my hair and all that so now I'm trying to decide if I should go red or blonde so comment down below all three of you that are watching this and tell me what I should do because your girl needs help so this is what I'm working with it's three days dirty Three hair makes for the best messy buns though, so can't complain. I see y'all. better now. You do. 